My name is Jorge Roder, and I want to talk about the artifact on the top part of the bass, which is a C extension. This is widely used in classical music, but also some people in jazz and improvised music have uh, attached these to their instruments. It's a little bit of an operation. You have to trim the nut to insert this ebony piece, and you uh, also create these ebony pieces called gates, which basically lower the sound from the original E sound. You open this gate, you have an E flat. You open this gate, you have a D. And you open this gate, you have a C sharp or D flat. And you open the final gate to a low rumbly C. <laughs> In order for this to work on a normal bass, the string needs to go all the way up to the top and then a hole is made so the string can travel then to a tuning peg and usually the lowest string would be on this tuning peg but because of this system we need to put it on this peg so now this is G D A and C or E I can play a lot of songs with open tuning for example one of my favorite gates to use is the D gate because I can play a lot of polyphony. Mm -hmm. 